Yo, what's good, everybody? It's your boy JTL back with another one. Before I get started, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. All right, this this gonna be an interesting. <laughs> this is gonna be an interesting one. All right. Virginia, you're 25 weeks for living. I'm actually a singer. I'm a singer and dancer. Um, I started singing when I was like 15. I was singing in bars and stuff. Yeah. Like, and I started on the side, you know, to make money. And, and, I'm, and I'm a business owner, so I, I do a lot of things, like fashion design. I just do a, I do a whole lot. Yeah. Okay. Well, first of all, let me first and foremost say this. Everybody out there, you can't do all these things at once and be successful. And that's the thing that young people think they can do. So if you hear somebody young, they're 20 saying that, you know, hopefully they'll grow out of it. But we all know better than that. If you, my age, <laughs> my age, you still say that, you tripping. Pick one thing. Get great at that, then move on to something else when that's sustainable. All right. It's your birthday, Jakari. Uh, my birthday is August twenty eighth, Virgo. Virgo. Um, no kids, I'm assuming. No, and I'm a boy, so. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think Kendra already knew that. <laughs> Y'all just peep how Kendra faces be on these types of videos. She know she be wanted to say the same thing guys be said, and just it just different for her because she bought I think she like forty five or something now. So uh, just peep her face. It's funny. I figured that you were a boy. Yeah. Okay. No. I, I just wanted to put all that out. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, Jakari, do you now? Do you date? You're saying gender? Yeah, I like boys. Okay, so you date boys. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> See, see, this is the thing. You you pretty much already said what the category was. Down low. They're gay, but they're just on the down low. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry to say this might be some dudes that didn't did some time before some years in, in the pen and, and and they came out and they still enjoyed it. You 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 hear those stories all the time. But this whole straight man, they're not straight. That whole non binary and all sorry, that's not reality. That's that's just not reality. They're not straight. They're not straight. Okay? But let's continue. So they so are you saying that when they initially approach you, they think that you're a female? Yeah. Oh, okay. Even when I was even when I was really young, people thought I was a girl in school, like substitute to be like, oh, go to the principal young lady. I would be so irritated. You know what I'm saying? Like I can't help it. That's natural. So Okay. So your preference is straight then? No, not anymore. Honestly, I'm tired of it. Yeah. So let's continue. What is your preference? What What do you desire? Um. Well, I want a man over six three. Yeah, I'm not gonna even. I'm not gonna hold you. I, I, of course, I gotta address that. I I don't see how people was calling him 
a girl, unless they was trying to be funny with the feminine thing. Like when he came on the live, you could tell it was a guy. So anyway, let's go to his uh, delusion. I want a man. He said he want a man over six three. <laughs> and uh, you know, it doesn't really matter about the skin color. I don't like. I don't really like white men though. So um, I like black men. Um, uh, let's see, hygiene is very important. Um. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I think that's pretty much it for me. Okay, do you have any deal breakers? Deal breakers is a lot of kids, um, girlfriends. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. Um, let's see. Deal breakers. Uh, you have to know how to love, like, your family. I, I respect the man that loves his mom. Um, because I think if you don't, if you don't love your mom, you can't respect me. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Especially since I'm the receiver. I'm the, yeah, the receiver in relationship, so. You're the receiver in the relationship. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can the guy have kids already? Um, can the guy have kids, you said? Yeah. I would say maybe two. Two, all right. But I love kids, though. So. You love kids. Mm -hmm. This is sorry. All right. All right. Uh, all right, all right, all right. All right, I'm going to do this. Okay, so anyway, uh... I'm going to just go ahead and stop it right here. <laughs> I'm going to just stop it right here. Okay. People already know you're a guy. Then you tell me you want somebody that's over 6'3". You want somebody to love their mama so they can love you because you're the female in the relationship. You want a guy with a, that's too many kids. Listen, I think this boils down to where the problem is, all right, is selfishness. So even... The guys that date guys that think they're women have these certain preferences as if, if they just got it going on, they just deserve whatever. And it's just the selfishness. And a lot of women are like that nowadays. And it's passed on to the guys who date guys. And then they think it's just cool to be all out here. No, I deserve this. And like, all right, whatever, how you feel. You know what I'm saying? And I know sadly enough, it seems like we be picking on these people. It's not, but it's just. The mindset, the uh, gender dysphoria that they deal with, it's not to pick on nobody because it's serious, but at the same time, when you, you speak the truth and all of that, people want to get mad at you. But a lot of these women cater to these things that's going on. You know what I'm saying? And uh, guys get it. You know, if you're dealing in the entertainment industry, we know that, you know, you're going to deal with these type of people. You know what I'm saying? So just be respectful. But at the same time, it's over six feet tall and prefer straight man now you don't want to deal with straight men and acting like they still straight when they not straight they dealing with you they don't care they got a girl come on i mean at least he said he don't want to deal with that no more just hopefully it'd be somebody that's out and open but it's just kendra show <laughs> it exposes a lot they talk trash by kevin samuels but i'm sure y'all have seen that kendra been going off on women lately which is one of the videos i'm gonna share with y'all shortly uh, and then I got that Megan Thee Stallion video coming up, of course. I got free time today. This is your boy JTI Opposite from the North. Make sure y'all hit that sub button, man, on our way to a thousand, God willing. We'll be back with more. You already know how we do over here. Chip!